have it for one night because we really need to move on, but oh, <laughs> we may not want to leave. This was made 100% on solar energy. How cool is that? It's an RV ladder. It's made very sturdy. Like every other part in RVs. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes dream spots do open up. <laughs> Cancel the next two weeks and just stay here for 14 days. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the view. We're never gonna leave. They're gonna have to kick us out. <laughs> on the hill view of Lee's Ferry Campground down there. Not a lot of sights, zero hookups, but there is potable water and a dump station over there, which it's free to use that dump station and get fresh water. Otherwise, I've heard it's like $30. So again, that National Park Pass is paying off. Now, if you have the senior agency pass, you can get half price. It's $20 per night here for dry camping or $10 if you do have the senior access pass. There is a 14 day stay limit here. So I don't think we're gonna be here long, but uh, just giving you the details, you can see the momentum way down there on the end. I mean, good views basically on any site. Got the mighty Colorado River down there. It's beautiful here. Oh, beautiful night to barbecue, some fillets. Oh, it's awesome, the wind died down. Good morning from Lee's Ferry. How you doing, honey? I'm good, how are you? Good. <laughs> Beautiful day, huh? Yeah, so awesome. Epic spot for an e-bike ride. to get back in shape, I'm gonna hike a uh, oh, three some mile trail here at Lee's Ferry. Let's do it. Just keeps getting deeper and deeper. <laughs> Crazy. It's like, yes, I am on another planet. This hike is no joke. In the 
Isn't that nuts? Recognize you guys. <laughs> <laughs> we hear that a lot, but uh, never. <laughs> What's your name? Mark. Mark? Mark and Kirsten. 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 I watch your videos all the time. Oh, awesome. Where, where are you staying? Uh, just up what? at the campground. Yeah, because that's where at we're at. Ferry? Yeah. Yeah, perfect. That's where we're heading. Oh, we'll there's a few. Tomorrow, we have the prime spot. Oh, yeah. right. So. Don't get too settled in. <laughs> yes. Go check out Site 45 where we are. It's like one of the best. Awesome. And it's on the river. Yeah. You, oh, so. and it feels very private. It is amazing. Enjoy your <laughs> journey. Thank yeah. You so much. Great to meet you guys. Let's see how close I was to guessing how this thing formed right there. <laughs> so you did have a guess, I, and it. I was remembering like from old uh, geology class in high school, and I used to be kind of a rock hound. No, he was, was a rock like, geek. He was a rock geek. Kind of my thing, mm -hmm. I guess. But basically, these big rocks fell off from up there and they landed and they kind of compacted the dirt below and provided shelter so that the rest of the dirt that wasn't compacted eroded away, kind of created like a pedestal oh. there. So, so it compacts it so much that even the weather doesn't affect it? Well, it acts like an umbrella. It shelters it. But wind? From the, from the rain. Well, what about wind? Well, yeah, it's eventually they will fall. Okay. Let's not be there when it happens. Yeah, we don't want to be under it, especially, because yeah. it looks don't, pretty big. Don't let that happen to you either. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, they will fall, and, you know, that's just kind of how erosion works. Yeah, but it's pretty cool. It's, it's, yeah, they're cool. It's like being on another planet. Yep. Over time, at least six feet of the surrounding loose ground was carried away, leaving an ever-growing pedestal with a balanced rock perched on top. That one right there. Looks like a mushroom. <laughs> and if you like to fish, we have seen a lot of people fishing right off the shore here on the Colorado River. A lot of fly fishing, actually. So that's pretty cool. Not sure what they're catching. Nice little uh, dirt pathway coming down the side of the mountain, I guess, from the campground here at Lee's Ferry uh, Campground and all the way down to the Colorado River right here. Let's go check it out. Hey, Cherie, I found the beach. <laughs> it's sandy. It's water, <laughs> probably cold. Beach tribe. <laughs> I didn't just say that. What's wrong, honey? I'm afraid of heights. <laughs> <laughs> Here I am dragging you up on top of the RV. He likes to drag me on top of the RV. It's not my favorite place. <laughs> like every time I take a step on the ladder, it creaks. I'm like, is this gonna thing gonna fall off? <laughs> <laughs> so how do we rate this site? Oh, a 10, 11, 12? best yet <laughs> one of the best yet of course on beach tribe so buy a honda still my top but yeah this is probably number two. Oh my gosh yeah we we hate to leave i mean this changed all of our plans yeah we were only going to be here one night we had a middle site then this thing opened up and it's like Oh. Right. Well, you know, we always talk about keeping flexible is your middle name. And not only for when things may go wrong or there's a hiccup in your travel day, but when things go right and you have an awesome site like this, keep flexible your middle name and stay a little extra. Yeah, we were <laughs> even still debating this morning. Like, I know. Do we stay an extra do one more day? day? <laughs> you know, I mean, the site is... So awesome, even though it's not very level. Uh, the other challenge, cell service is terrible Ter out here. Our internet was terrible. Our internet there. was terrible yeah. here. But it was worth it. <laughs> but 
you know, you throw that out and a lot of you don't need that kind of stuff. Right. You want to get away from it and wow, this was the place to get away. Yes, it is. It's so quiet and peaceful except for us shouting from the top of an RV. <laughs> but we're and, doing this for you. And people <laughs> staring at us and wondering what, like, are, those what are they doing up crazy there? Crazy people doing. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we do one more like a 360 of the view here? As long as you don't get me towards the edge. Spin, your, spin <laughs> you around and make you dizzy? Yeah. Make me dizzy before I go down on an RV ladder. Oh my I God. Mean, yeah, really every site has <laughs> awesome views okay, here. that's good. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, this is site 45. Yeah. And we're super excited, actually. We met uh, some people that watch our channel, Mark and Kirsten, right Yay! over here in a Class A. They're almost full time, so congratulations, yeah. guys. Yeah, and we told them about the site, so they have come over this morning. We gave them a heads up that we were leaving. We said, don't get too comfortable where you are because you're yes. gonna want this site. And so they have already filled out the ticket and they are ready to pull in. Yeah, because it's like vultures here <laughs> for good sites. Everybody waits for you to leave the good site. And then people... Well, we did the same thing. We were the exactly, vultures. Exactly. <laughs> totally. But it's a great tip on, you know, how to get really good sites. So, if you like this video, would you give it a thumbs up? Thumbs up. And if you're brand new to our channel, make sure you subscribe. And would you camp here? Would you camp here? I, I think that's an easy answer. Easy answer. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. My arm is shaking. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> so long. And remember, enjoy, enjoy your, your journey. journey. <laughs> there you go. All right. Let's, let's roll. What's next? I don't know. <laughs>